Oh yeah, uh, social media is a brilliant tool, especially for people like me who are bedridden, can't leave the house and just not well enough for visitors or any other human contact. I've met some wonderful people online and have fantastic support from some very special friends. I, I really value their companionship and the times when I've been far too ill to use my phone or go online at all. I felt so desperately lonely and unhappy. Um, there is, of course, the massive energy drain that these things have. Looking at a screen is very tiring and can cause a lot of eye and head pain. There's such information overload, so many things in my feed and messages and notifications, and I, I do get so very confused with it all. I'd, I'd like to respond to everyone and, and read everything, but I just can't, just can't do it. Even navigating these sites is difficult for me and I haven't got the physical resources to spend on finding my way about. There's just too much mental processing. It, it's so overwhelming and energy consuming and, and I, I even have to time myself so I don't overdo it, so I don't do too much. Now I'm on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. Twitter mostly for Emmy stuff and a few interests, Facebook for friends and the Emmy community and Instagram for mostly music. Now on Instagram I have only a few friends or people that really know me uh, or know how rubbish my life is and how ill I am and, and that I can't do anything. Um, it, it's totally an Emmy free zone where I go to escape and pretend everything is fine and only a few know otherwise. I follow mostly musicians and artists on Instagram, so in my feed I have mainly music related stuff rather than people's holiday snaps or trips to the zoo or children's parties or other things. It's not that I don't want to see them, I'm really interested in what my friends are up to, but Facebook is mainly where I like to see and join in conversation with those things. And even there I don't join in or say it anywhere near as much as I want. Also, when I open my Instagram account there may be 15 or so pictures in my feed to look at which is a very small amount that I can cope with so that that's why I haven't followed people back or haven't responded I really don't mean to ignore anyone but I need that private little space for pictures of nice stuff and escapism and is untouched by illness it's it's easy communication by pictures and also not many people say anything to me on there so I don't get drawn into long conversation and so it's become a safe, low energy place for me to go. Anyway, I, I thought I'd just let people know how it is for me. I wish I could get round to everyone, but I have to do things at the pace my health dictates. Basically, I want to chat and play, but I'm just not able to. But So anyway, thanks for listening. Bye.